You have a lump and it could be breast cancer. Those are words no woman wants to hear. After the initial shock comes a ton of questions. What does my diagnosis mean? What types of surgery should I have? What about chemo or radiation? It can be overwhelming. That's why doctors at Mayo Clinic developed a new educational tool. It's designed to help women diagnosed with breast cancer get the information they need to help make their journey a little easier. It takes a while for it all to sink in. Earlier this year, Jan Pankratz was diagnosed with stage one breast cancer. There's so much information to process. It's hard to even um, formulate questions when you're so overwhelmed with a lot of information. Dr. Sandhya Pruthi uses a new computerized education tool to help Jan sort it all out. I'm gonna show you what the term ductal means. A visual tool to alleviate fear by helping Jan understand her diagnosis, her treatment options, and what'll happen to her body. What I wanted to do was to take away that fear of that overwhelming knowledge, start with the basics, and then teach it in a stepwise process. Dr. Pruthi tested this tool in a study and found that women who used it had a better understanding of their disease and also had less anxiety. The computerized tool combines video and colored images to explain the pathology of the different breast cancers, staging and grade, and surgical, medical, radiation, and reconstructive treatment options. This is how tamoxifen works. Those terms that you've never heard before that mean nothing to you, to tie it visually to what was going on inside your body was uh, a huge um, tool for me to make decisions and feel like I was informed and know what I was actually deciding on. Providing thorough information to hopefully make the experience of breast cancer a little easier. Dr. Pruthi says this computerized educational tool is not just for patients, it's also for doctors to make sure they communicate and equip breast cancer patients with all the information they need to make informed decisions. Dr. Pruthi hopes to make this tool available to institutions worldwide. For Medical Edge, I'm Vivian Williams.